What is up, Flock? Phoenixville here, and welcome to some Hogwarts Legacy. Now, um, I'm going to start off by saying two things. One, I am a little bit under the weather. I've been having uh, congestion, or whatever you want to call it, all day. Uh, so if you hear sniffling, or if even me sneezing, and all that throughout the video, I'm sorry. Uh, this just came out, uh, well, uh, if you pre-ordered the Deluxe Edition, you got 72 hours early. This just came out, uh, so I were, really wanted to play it. I really wanted to check it out. Um, the other thing is, technically, I pre-ordered this as a gift for my wife. So, <laughs> um, I am currently playing under her account, so I have to use a different recording software because my usual recording software is through my Steam account, and I can't use it while I'm on her account. It's so dumb. Uh, she has access to all my games, but yet, for some reason... They don't allow me to have access to action. I, I don't get it. But I'm using a different recording software. Already proven to be a problem because uh, I thought I was recording and uh, I wasn't. So hopefully this works. I've already played through uh, a certain portion. Uh, I won't give it away. But I've, I've, I've gotten to the point where I get locked in a safe. That's all I'll say. So anything up until then... Uh, I, I've already seen after that is all new to me so without further ado let's go ahead and get into this uh, so it has her I've already deleted my character but it's her account so she has her character there hey keep an eye make sure it's recording we are pleased to inform you that you have been accepted to Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry as a fifth year student the term begins on September 1st Preliminary supplies have been collected for you and will accompany you on your journey to the castle. As you may be aware, the decree for a reasonable restriction of underage sorcery prohibits the use of magic by those under the age of 17 outside school. However, due to your unique circumstances, the ministry has graciously allowed Professor Elazar Fig to help you hone your spell casting before you are escorting you from London to the castle for the start of the term feast and sorting ceremony. Yours sincerely, Professor Weasley, Deputy Headmistress. Which, when I played through this first time, I was a bit bummed because it sounds like we're not going to be able to take the Hogwarts Express, which would have been cool. And uh, the other thing is, Professor Weasley? Hmm. All right. So let's go ahead and start the game. We gotta start off by customizing our character. And I went with this guy. Yeah, I think this guy. And then we did, we did this one. Actually, I think I might. Yeah, I think we went with this one. And then I did you can get Howie Paul glasses, or you can get Dumbledore glasses, but I went with these. And then I went with the palest I could go with, because I'm pale. Alright, moving on to hair. Is this the hair I went with? No. I went with, like, I don't think it was that swishy. I think I went with this one. Yeah, no, I think I'm with this one. All right. Hair color, we can keep it dark brown. Moving on to scar. Oh, I, I did. I'm not quite sure what that does. What if we turn that off? I'm not quite sure that changes, but alright. And then I did this scar, I believe? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then we'll move on to eye color. That eye color. Left the eyebrows alone, or eyebrow color alone. I did. Uh. I think I did those, or maybe I did, I did those. Yep. Alright. And then... I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. Yeah, we'll do the voice one. It was wonderful. 
I believe I'm really going. I'm eager to get. I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. Okay, so maybe that was my problem because the last time I uh, started off, a few it, it was wonderful. I believe I'm really. His going voice to is robotic, but if I left I'm it, I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. A few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing to be concerned about. If I leave it like that, it sounds normal. And then we did easy. I was gonna go to story, but I chose easy because I want some gameplay challenge. And then our name is Phoenix Poe, and we are a wizard. Start our journey. So far, it's still recording, so that's a plus. Do do. Ah. It appears we are almost ready to depart. Almost. It's a pity we didn't have a bit more time to spend on spell casting. I presume you've been practicing the spells we worked on. I have, Professor. Well, I have. I'm quite sure I've never seen anyone take so quickly to a second-hand wand. You'll cool, be forced Al. to be reckoned with. Shame what happens to. <laughs> Thank you, Professor Fig. I appreciate you working with me before the time begins. Oh, <laughs> Eleazar. George, glad my George. rather cryptic description of our location did not thwart your findings. Wait, what's George I've the last to more George to find destinations than this. <laughs> Though I confess I may have miscalculated slightly on my first try. <laughs> Gave quite the fright to some theatergoers in the West End. <laughs> it's been much too long. When I received your owl, I must uh, say I... Best not speak here, Eleazar. Hmm? Of course. Why don't we speak en route to Hogwarts? We have a start of term feast and a sorting ceremony to get to. Wonderful idea! As long as your young charge here doesn't mind me tagging along. Not at all, sir. After you. I do. Ages since I've been to the castle. Would be good to see the old pile of rocks. What's he looking at? I didn't notice that the first time. Notice this though. Curious. Very curious. Warner Brother Games. Or excuse me, Warner Bros. Games. Avalanche. What key game, Wizarding World? We're flying. I just love how Harry and Ron take a flying car and everybody loses their mind. They're just flying around just in a carriage pulled by nothing and nobody says a word. And who is your traveling companion? A new student. You. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. I'm starting school as a fifth year. How extraordinary. It is indeed. None of the faculty has ever heard of anyone being admitted to Hogwarts so late. Nor have I. Of course, as the other fifth years weird. have been honing their magical skills for four years now, the headmaster asked if I could get our new student up to speed a bit before the term begins. Well... Hopefully we find out why he missed the first four years. Professor Fig is not only an exceptional teacher, he's also a remarkably intuitive and gifted wizard. Mr. Osborne Never heard is him. prone to flattery. Now, we should say. I dare say it's one of the reasons he's risen so far at the ministry. <laughs> <laughs> he said you're a kiss this? butt. <laughs> I have. Gobbledygook. Opinions differ as to how great a threat Ranrock really is. Although I've yet to convince my colleagues at the Ministry, I believe he is a significant threat. And it was your wife, Eleazar, who alerted me to his activities months ago. Miriam? How? <sighs> she wrote to me about Ranrock before she died. It's a big eye. Wondering what the Ministry knew about his activities. Before I could respond, I received this it was the last thing she sent me Eleazar it came to me via her owl but with no correspondence 
I can only assume that she had to get rid of it quickly to keep it safe. Presumably from Ranrock. I cannot open it. Whatever magic protects this is powerful indeed. It looks like goblin metal. That symbol. What's that glow? I don't see a glow. Nor do I. Merlin's beard. How did you wait? We do. The messed up now, Eamon. Yo, mama's not gonna be too happy about that one. Packing wizards now. Well, that was a neat detail when I first played through. People can only see him if they've seen death or witness death. He watched the guy die. He watched the guy die. You could see him. I love how the the driver just like was like, "I'm out of here." Whoop. The key. Give me your hand. The driver just well, yeet. I'm out. Squirrel. Are you alright? You're hurt. Perhaps a bit. Take Perhaps this. a bit. It's Wigan World Potion. This guy's face. Stuff will write you in a second. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> that face you make when you're taking a poop. Yeah, there's splashback. <laughs> What happened? Poor George. I can't believe he... What the hell got into that Screw, screw George, what about Attacking our owl? carriage mid-air? A typical dragon would never... Professor? <sighs> Sir, where are we? We're I'm in a cave. Sure. But that key you discovered was clearly a port key. Port key? An item enchanted to bring whoever touches it to a specific place. I'm feeling better, sir, if you'd like to look around a bit. I would. But stay close. We've no idea who created this port key. Or why. We Got wore the tires a little bit. I'm gonna lie, I was there. Far did that port key take us? Farther from London far, far than the away. carriage traveled. We're somewhere in the Scottish Highlands. Sir, those ruins. Do you think... The port key was meant to lead us there? I do. This has not been the day either of us expected. But Miriam sent that port key to George for a reason. And I believe that she, and now George, died in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to. If you're sure you're all right and wouldn't mind indulging me, I'd like to have a look around. Absolutely, sir. Good. Let's see if we can find a path, however faded it may be. Bro, let's find a path. There's this giant path right in front of us. Mind your step. Mind yours. Where do you suppose Stop looking your back wife at me. Watch where you go. That brought us here. A good question. Miriam spent years searching for evidence of a long-forgotten form of ancient magic. Ancient magic? This doesn't yes, sound good. A powerful magic wielded by a rare few that seems to have been lost to time. Hogwarts Castle was built by and is itself a stronghold of that ancient magic. I don't know where she came into possession of the port key, but I am certain it was to do with that search. Ah, there's the path down below. This way. But sir, oh, poor guy. Wife searching for evidence of lost magic. 
Miriam wanted to understand why such powerful magic disappeared from the wizarding world. Spoke of the good it could do. But magic is no different than any power. What really matters is the one who wields it. It's obsidian. Is that ice? It's not cold enough here. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Someone wanted to block this path. Let's see some of that <clears throat> one work you were practicing. Ooh. Focus on the center. Yeah. Excellent. Yep. No more about that. Let's go. Wee. <laughs> a bit rougher than I'd expected. Your wand work's improving with every cast. Thank you, sir. Don't mind me. Ah, up there. Ugh. We're close now, it's just ahead. <laughs> Dang, I was trying to hit the bird. Steady yourself! Reparo! Hey guys, why don't you uh, like, uh, teach me that spell? Hmm? See the little backspin I did? That was pretty neat. All right. Why would someone have built this here? I suspect they valued their privacy. Yeah, no, no lie. Here for a reason. Let's have a look around for anything that seems out of place. Yep, got that. All right. Professor, it's a mural of some kind. Mm. <laughs> He's That's putting his arm around me. Seer. Interesting. It's a shield. Professor, this statue. This Dumbledore. May have been his home. Well, he's got no vases left or bosses. That enchanted crystallized stone again. But what could it be blocking? What's this? Professor Fig! Ooh, hello. Kevin, right, there he is. At first, I thought someone was running up on us from behind. How odd! <laughs> I played through last. Why night. would someone have conjured that enchanted stone here? And how is there a room behind it? What room? I don't see anything. There's that glow again, like the glow on the port key container. Whispering. What in Merlin's name? Godric's heart. Where are we? I don't believe it. Oh man. Sorry. Wake the goblin. <laughs> That's what I'm gonna start calling it. Wake the goblin. You ho. Hello. You ho. Wake <sighs> up. <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> oh, 
Just a moment. <laughs> oh, <clears throat> uh, where <anything> here? <clears throat> Welcome to Gringotts Wizarding Bank. Vault number twelve, I presume. <clears throat> Precisely. Gringotts has come a long, long way, man. The key. White's portkey. Mr. Potter oh, have his yes, key. Yes, of course. <laughs> this way, then. Oh wait, no. Stay close. Okay, I get it. Yeah. That's how he knew. After you. After you. <laughs> Inside the cars, if you don't wish to lose them. <laughs> this is a pretty trippy ride. How many vaults are there, Gringotts? Hundreds. In fact, you'll see quite a few on our way to vault number 12. As we speak, we're just beneath the main lobby. The vaults you see now are the newest. Are private entrances to the bank common at Gringotts? They are That's why I didn't understand the first time. Only one with great wealth or power, or both, could have arranged for such a service. You'll want to take a breath. A what? Oh, we're gonna get wet. That waterfall washes away all enchantments. It's a security measure. Experienced the thief's downfall before, have you? Heard of it? These are the lower vaults that we're passing now. How deep are we going? Vault number 12 was commissioned shortly after Gringotts was founded over four centuries ago. Yay. It resides in the deepest part of the bank. Settle in. We've quite a distance to go. <laughs> Leave it to the goblins to make everything backwards. Just Usually they'd start from the top and work their way down. But they're starting from the bottom and worked their way up. Vault number. Vault 12. Momentous day. <laughs> hmm. Mm, no white way. fish. That's a bit suspicious. Professor, hmm? the armband that guard was wearing was glowing. Like the glow you saw on the porky container? No, darker. I saw that same glow on the dragon's collar. Yeah, what was that? We were just wondering about that goblin back there. He watches over the oldest section of the bank. Rare anyone goes there anymore. This thing's massive. When was the last time this vault was accessed? A goblin has been stationed at my desk for hundreds of years. In that time, no one has visited Vault 12. No one? Until today. Thank you for your help. I think I'll just stay out here. Because I know what happens once I go in here. What do you suppose we should be looking for? I'm not sure. Sir, I wonder if you might... The instructions for Vault 12 indicate that I am to grant access to the holder of the key and then close the door. Wait! 
Professor Black. And this is where I die. Professor, that was certainly unexpected. Let me think. There must be something here. Hmm, Revelio, perhaps. Revelio? Yes, a revealing charm. No time like the present. Let's see what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand and focus. 